Some people wonder what it's like to train for an adventure race. Well, I'm about to give you a glimpse into what I do to get ready. I'll spare you the introductory 25 mile bike ride. And as you can see, I am now smack dab in the middle of nowhere. Nothing around us. Nothing at all. Some of the images you may see are disturbing. But that's too bad. Well, here I am now. Out in this beautiful lake. Nobody around for miles. Which is the beautiful part of Iowa. I mean, you can just go and go and go. And you might not ever see another person for a very long time. And that's the beauty of Iowa. I mean, Missouri's nice, Illinois is great, but to be so desolate, it's awesome. I'll be right back. One of the things I like to do when I train is be as minimalist as possible. Survive off what Mother Nature provides. One of my favorite things to eat are like these little these little bean little bean things. I I don't know what they're called, but it's a, good, it, it's a good little snack. It's kind of hard this time, time of year, so you gotta, you know, find one. And then, yeah, that's not good, I'm not gonna lie. But, in a survival situation, you gotta do what you gotta do. Ah, 96. 97, 98, 99, oh, 100. Oh man, I just did so many push ups, I can barely feel my arms. My arms are numb. Oh. One of the perils of training in the minimalist style is about halfway through the bike ride, I'm usually around mile 50, out of water. Luckily, I know what to do. Down the hatch. It's like fresh mountain water. Yup. Yup. So, because you never know what the race director is going to have you do, you got to add in some mystery events to your training. Sometimes. I like to ride my bike through the worst part of town. No need to yell racial slurs. Right before I turned this camera on, I just yelled Hawkeye suck at the top of my lungs. Hopefully that'll bring out the neighbors and I can play a little Dodge the Rock. <laughs> yep. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> I see you can't get me. I'm like a speeding demon bullet. Increased lightning. I'm invincible. Well, that's all right. And now you know what it takes to train for an adventure race.